Recently, a remarkable story was uncovered in the news. An SD card was found inside a camera by some Spanish fishermen. And despite spending one year on the seabed, the photos were still retrievable. The owners of the said camera were apparently on a cruise and managed to take a few photos before it somehow went overboard. And the rest, as they say, is history. So we've devised a little test to see how tough SD cards really are. And here are the SD cards we're gonna test. We're gonna do a SanDisk Extreme SDHC card, 16 gigabytes, because we're not cheapskates. Ow, why do they make packaging so ridiculous? There we are, that's one. And we're also gonna compare it with a cheaper alternative. This is an A-Data card. Let's put the SD card in. It's the SanDisk first. Here we are. This is the Guardian website. And it says the 26th of February. And surely they would not lie about that. Let me take a picture of this screen. Now let's take a little video of the fishy. Now let's do the same for the A-Data. So we've got some shots and some video. Now it's time to put it on the water. Sorry, just the SD card. So first off, we've got the sand disk. And then the A data. And the sand disk is floating for some reason. Nine out of ten fish prefer sand disk apparently. Now that we've dunked our SD cards, let's wait a month to see what happens. One month on and it's time to fish out the SD cards. Unfortunately, they had a bit of a lover's tiff, resulting in the other one moving in with another fish. So we gave Matey Boy here a few toys to keep him company. But the question is, will they still work after one month underwater? Well, let's find out. Oops. Right, I'm gonna give the SD cards a quick wash now. One, because they stink, and two, because I don't wanna fill this D90 with any more fecal matter than it already has. Right, here comes the moment of truth. Let's try the sand disc out first. Yes. Now let's try the cheap and cheerful A-Data card to see if it works. Oh, that doesn't look good. One month underwater has killed this A-Data SD card. Let's put in a D90 to see if it still works. Seems like the card is deader than a dodo. And not even an option to format the memory card. And voila. Oh, the conclusion to our not so scientific test is that if you plan to go dunking your SD card in the water for one month or longer, then the sand disc is the way to go. The A-Data, well, that can go back in.